Hey guys, so I know this is a really weird, different viewing angle for you guys. And you can see my lips are really weird, like I just was a vampire or something and sucked someone's blood. Um, so this video is inspired by Valentine's Day, and yes, I'm wearing all red. I just took up off my lipstick because this video is a DIY kind of lip ombre inspired by Valentine's Day. So instead of doing dark colors because I just tried that earlier, didn't work. So I'm going to do a really pretty um, pink and gold look for Valentine's Day. So this ombre lip look, it's going to be a pink and a peach and any shimmery gold eyeshadow that you have because it's going to be like a goldish pink, nice, really sweet Valentine's Day lip ombre look. That's a lot of L's, a lot of alliteration. So I'm going to be using um, probably this one. This is a CoverGirl um, Blast Flipstick Blendable Lip Duo. Um, if you guys have ever seen me use this, it's 805 Pucker. We're going to use the side, um, this bright fuchsia pink right here. And also, um, this Aquamere, Aquamere, Aquamere. That's French. Hawaii. Um, this is just a really nice, pretty, corally peach color. And then the eyeshadow that I'm going to be using is, um, it's like a gold. It's going to be this shimmery gold right here, if you guys can see that. So first we're going to start off with the, oh, I'm going to do the peach on the inside and then the pink on the outside. So let's do the peach first. So as you can see, this is a very, like, metallic-y peach. And then we're going to get the pink, which I believe it's this one. Yep. And we're going to go on the outside. So you should end up something similar to this, which is a peach orange in the middle and then a fuchsia pink on the outside. And right now, I'm just going to get a q-tip and clean up the edges. Alright, so now that the edges are more defined and cleaner, we are going to get the last thing, which is the gold eyeshadow. Very pretty. And you can use your fingertip, you could use a q-tip, you could even use a brush if you want. Make sure it's clean though, because that would be a little nasty. So you're just going to get any finger you want that's clean. Make sure you wash your hands before and after. Um, and we're going to put this in the middle, right on top of the orange, peach, whichever color you have in the middle. And make sure you use a finger, a different finger each time, because as you can see, I got lipstick on there, and you don't want to put it back and forth and then, then, no. Get a different finger. And then, different finger. Last finger. So now, you should have something that's pink and it's like you kissed gold powder. Now, uh, wipe your fingers off on something like a napkin. Make sure you have napkins, q-tips, wet rag, something to clean off your hands. You're going to get a q-tip and you're just going to really kind of blend it in a little bit. Not too much because we don't want it all the same color. We want it too different because it's an ombre, it's going to blend a little bit between. Alright, and that is it. As you can see, you can see them pretty well. Well, let's flip it over to this one. 
So you guys can always add either more gold in the middle if you want it more defined or more pink on the outside or even dark pink on the outside just to make it look like you have fuller lips. But this is the pink gold ombre Valentine's Day look that I wanted to show you guys because I've been, since I have so many lipsticks now, I wanted to really experiment um, of what kind of DIY lip ombres or something like that to show you guys. So this is one of my favorites because it's really pretty and light and it's not too crazy like dark ones or anything but that is it for this video. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, give it a thumbs up and comment down below if you guys want to see more lip ombre looks. Maybe like um, for more spring, like lighter pinks than a fuchsia or anything. But um, yeah, that's it. I hope you guys are having a wonderful Friday. I'll see you guys next Friday with a brand new video. Bye! And just to let you know, I am giving out free shout outs. So if you want a shout out for your channel, just open up the description box down below and go all the way at the bottom. There's a paragraph I typed up. Um, just read that and just leave a comment and I'll give you a shout out in the next video.